Okay, why is it so off-centered? Maybe that's better. Still off-centered. Maybe I need to move. <laughs> there we go. Okay, let's see if we can get this started. Why does it look so fuzzy on YouTube? Okay, good morning. Hi, Bonnie. Hi, Ponzi. Hi, Debbie. Good morning. On YouTube, does it look like a little fuzzy? It looks fuzzy to me. Maybe the lens is dirty. Does I go in there like that? <laughs> I don't know. I can't tell. On YouTube, on my camera, it looks fine, but on YouTube, it looks a little blurry. Hi, Sandy. Hi, Russ. Good morning. Hi, Rhoda. Hi, Stephanie in Indiana. Hi, Anne in Texas. Hi, Sandra D. Hi, Kathy on Facebook. Hi, Brenda on Facebook. Hi, Gloria, my love. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Did you go to Carter's game yesterday? Ben played so good on Saturday. Hi, Sanal. Hello in Tampa, Florida. Hi, Brenda in Baton Rouge. Hi, Joe. Good morning. Gina says, yeah, it's fuzzy. Okay, hang on. I was going to use my, well, hang on. I'll just use my shirt. Hang on. I'm going to try to like clean the lens, which I'm sure this is probably not a good idea, but it does look fuzzy. Okay. Ooh, is that almost better? Except for the light right above my head. Look, it looks like it's shining right on my head. Uh, let me move closer. Um, does that look a little better? I wonder if that looks a little better. It almost looks like it does to me. It almost looks better to me. Chris, hello from New York. Oh, Russ says it's better. Oh, see, the t-shirt wins again. That's how I clean um, Miller's glasses all the time is with my t-shirt, poor baby. He got new glasses, you guys. He looks so cute. They're a little bigger because he's growing up. Hi, Lori. She said, I made it to a No Makeup Monday. Welcome. Hi, Kathy in Ohio. Um, Jeannie says, I got, just got the notification. What did I miss? You know what, Jeannie? Nothing yet. I just had to clean the lens because it looked dirty. But other than that, you have not missed anything. Hi, Melinda, New Hampshire. Hi, Kathy. She said it looks better now. Yay. Hi, Susan, Wisconsin. Cindy said, happy birthday to your mom. Did she get lots of cards? She did. And there's a stack on my counter. So my mom, yes, today is my mom's birthday. Horrible day to have a birthday because we all just need to take a second and remember what happened. So many, well, it was a lot. It feels, it feels like yesterday to probably a lot of us as we watched most of it on TV. Um, the most probably horrific event in my lifetime for the United States. Uh, uh, I, um, as a kid, um, I, when I was 13, I went to a, on a school trip to New York, Philadelphia, and Washington, D.C. And I got to go to the top of the World Trade Center. And at the time, it was a very important thing for me because my dad worked for a company that was trying to do a World Trade Center on our West Coast. And so it was a big deal for me to see what my dad's company was trying to do, right? And uh, I don't think that really ever really came to fruition. They have something, but nothing like that. And so it was a really big deal for me. And so um, I felt like, you know, I mean, I think a part of all of our hearts broke that day. So, but now it is my mom's birthday. And she did get a lot of cards, so thank you so much. I, my plan is to um, to get that uh, those shown on camera eventually. Uh, qu Stamping Kitty says, question, when will the We Are Memory Kem Keepers multi-cinch tool be restocked? It is on order, and American Crafts is 100% sold out. They are telling me November. November. So bummer to a lot of us. November. Uh, Jeannie said she used to work at the World Trade Center about 15 years before 9-11. Oh, goodness. Um, let's see. Hi, Polly. Hello. Um, Cookie is, I don't know where she is. I don't know where she is. She um, got something to tell you about that. Hey, Kathy, she said she's in Salt Lake City. She's watching from the Huntman's Cancer Center waiting to get my chemotherapy shot. Kathy, hello, my love. I have actually been to that place. I've been to that cancer center for my uncle. So big hugs to you. It's a beautiful facility and I know they really know what they're doing. So I'm glad you're getting um, the proper care. So big hugs to you, my love and prayers. Hang on with Kathy. Um, because chemotherapy is nothing to be, whew, but at the same time, it can save you, right? So that's all that matters. Um, uh, Oki says, my great, great niece is scheduled to arrive today. Yay. Bonnie said her granddaughter was born on 9-11. Yeah. Hi, Nancy, my love. 
It is the 12th anniversary of her sudden cardiac arrest. Nancy and you are still kicking it. I love it. I love it. Okay, so my mom, um, Annette says, why can't we see the live chat replay when watching the past No Makeup Mondays? Annette, that is a very good question. You should send that question to YouTube because they don't allow it. I don't know why. There's been so many live videos that I've needed to watch from like business um, uh, lives that I've tried to watch, like to learn more about stuff, and they don't show you the chat. I don't know why. It's weird. Um, hi, Jan. She says it's cooling down in Kansas. It is actually raining here in Southern California. Uh, wow. Russ says there are some scenes from the movie Godspell that take place on top of one of the World Trade Center towers before construction. Oh, wow. Oh, Teresa said it was a horrible day for us. Her, uh, she had cousins working in the tower too. Oh gosh. Oh, that's awful. Yeah. Connie says, I love the new skunk die set. Thank you. Um, who will receive your skunk cards? <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not sure. That's funny. The gift tag. I know Pamela, that gift tag is the bomb. Let me tell you. And I want you guys to sell those to your friends that aren't crafty. You would sell a boatload of those finished projects to your friends that are not crafty because everybody gives gift cards nowadays, right? Um, Kathy, uh, she says, it's a great place and my team is just wonderful. That is awesome. That is awesome. I'm glad to hear that, Kathy. I'm glad to hear that. Um, uh, Aloha Ivy from Hawaii. Okay, so my mom's birthday. Uh, if you'll remember last week, a week ago, we went to Chuck E. Cheese with the children, the four young ones in the family, Ben Carter, Liam and Miller. Um, and we went to Chuck E. Cheese, had a wonderful time. Then, oh, and I have a picture of it and I, 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 I need to show you the picture of it, but I don't have it here. Then um, la oh, Saturday night, we went to a dinner for my mom, just the adults. And that was really fun too. Today is her official birthday. She is coming over today. Um, we Every Monday, uh, all four generations get together. So it's my mom, my dad, my kids, the baby, the boys, the little boys, the twins, and then Ken and Stephanie. My brother's family is a little further away, so they can't make it. But we just literally just get together and do nothing and eat. <laughs> That's what we do. So everybody comes over around four. They leave about seven and we just hang. It's kind of nice to do it on a Monday, which is totally random. I don't know how this started. I started it like a year ago. And, but it's nice because it doesn't take time away from your weekend plans. And it's just, everybody knows they show up at my house on Mondays. It's really cool. So, uh, yeah, my mom, um, will be getting to see her cards. Uh, and I have something that I haven't been showing. I have a couple cards I haven't shown, so I really need to show them. Um, so I'm putting it on my lap, so don't forget. So my mom will get her cards. I will show them probably next week on video. Uh, my mom is way too shy to go on live video, so she won't be doing that. But um, she uh, is going to be so excited to see those cards. Let's see. Uh, oh, we went to Knott's Berry Farm with the babies on Friday. I can hear the rain. Hope we don't have a leak. How come I can hear so much rain? Um, so we took the babies, the boys, three and a half, to Knott's Berry Farm. We got there at 9.55. They opened at 10. So we waited in line for a couple minutes. The longest line we were in was to get into the park. It was awesome. We had their stroller. I only drank $15.75 worth of Diet Cokes. I got three. They were $5.25 each for a cup this big. But I had my, you know, my $35 pass. So it's good for a year and a half, which is good. Uh, we went on... I think it was 10 rides total. We went on some double. So I was counting those in the whole 10. So in two hours and 15 minutes, we went on 10 rides, which is really good. At one point, there was no lines at all. So at one point, uh, I looked at the lady that was taking, getting us out of our seats. And I said, can we just stand again? There's no line. She goes, of course. So we got to go on again without getting out, getting out of our little car. Um, they absolutely positively loved it. However, they did not go on any rides by themselves. They only went on rides that where Nana and Gaga could go with them. So uh, we had a wonderful, wonderful time. Uh, Miller did see somebody with an ice cream and he said, Nana, I want an ice cream. And for some reason I was able to uh, convince him that there was a new ride over there we hadn't tried and he forgot all about the ice cream. So hi, Melody, my love. So he did not get 
ice cream, which is good because they really didn't eat anything good for them. Uh, we did, this is so funny and they're going to hate me in 20 years if they ever watch this video. We did have to take in their little potty into the stroller in the bottom of the stroller. Nobody could see it. So it wasn't a big deal. They have a big stroller um, because they don't go on big potties yet. They only go on their little potty still. And so when they had to go potty, we just took it into the bathroom and sat it down on the floor and then they went and then we had to put it on. Oh, yeah. But it worked. That's all that matters. And they had a great time. So I'm already planning our next trip. <laughs> so that was really exciting. Thank you, Kelly. She said, happy birthday to your mom. Teresa did too. Thank you. Janet did too. Thank you. So uh, that was really exciting. They had a very good time. They uh, did not fall asleep on the way home, so it was good. And then they came here to our house and then they fell asleep for their nap. So that worked out great. So I'm trying to convince uh, my brother and my sister-in-law, Gloria, you got to help me, that their children do not need to go to school on a Friday. <laughs> And I want to take all four boys because they have passes too. My mom got them passes, I think, last year. So they have passes through the rest of this year. So I want to take all four boys early on a Friday morning um, for two hours because Ben and Carter, you wouldn't think a 12 and 10 year old would be good with little kids. They are amazing with the little ones. Ben like just gets them in. Hi, Gail. You're supposed to be at work. Um, they, they uh, she, he, Ben gets them involved and they play and they had fun. They had a blast at Chuck E. Cheese. And I know our little ones would have a fun time with Ben and Carter, even, even though ben, poor Ben and Carter wouldn't be able to go to anything but Camp Snoopy. So I don't know if they really want to do that. I don't know, but, um, maybe we could let Ben go on a fast, uh, roller coaster ride really quick. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But, um, speaking of the babies, I've had this forever and I feel horrible. Norma, are you here, my love? Um, Norma, find, let me know if you're here. Um, she sent me a wonderful note and uh, a cute card. She made a cute card that said, thank you. And it says, aloha. She was in Maui during the fires. They got evacuated at 3.30 in the morning. It, uh, she said it was uh, devastating. She was glad that we were in Cancun instead. So Norma, are you here, my love? Oh, Norma, is that you? Is that the right Norma? Norma, is that you? Hang on, because it doesn't have a last name on here. Um, I don't have a last name. But Norma, is this you that you gave me this and you sent me a gift that I want to show everybody? Let me know, Norma, on Facebook if that was you. Um uh, Cynthia, my daughter has that um, toilet seat also that is like a one that goes with the lid. Yeah, she has one of those. Deborah says we can sign a petition for your brother to let them go. I love you, Deborah. That's so awesome. I'm going to tell my brother you said that. That is so funny. Bonnie says, Feliz cumpleaños to Polly. Thank you. I wonder if she'll know what that means. She doesn't speak Spanish very well, uh, which is funny because my mom taught when she taught school, she taught primarily it was I would say 98 percent of her classes were um, Mexican or Hispanic. And they would always the teach the parents would request if they didn't know her, they would request her because her name was Mrs. Sanchez thinking she spoke Spanish. My mom doesn't speak a lick of Spanish. <laughs> kind of funny, but you know. I don't know. Uh, Norma, are you the same Norma that's on Facebook? I haven't seen you bring a, um, uh, say something in the chat. Let me double check. Uh, the, the chat on Facebook does not work very good. Okay, so I'm just going to move forward with what Norma sent. So Norma sent half birthday presents for the little boy, the little boys. And she sent, and uh, she's an angel because she put little things on it. I haven't given it to him yet because I had to keep them nice. But she sent these cute little Lego guys and she's so smart because she knew that I had to have exactly the same for the boys because if you don't have exactly the same, World War III will break out. But um, they're cute little Lego guys. And she said she didn't notice that they said um, five plus on them, but they don't put things in their mouth anymore. So they will be able to use these. And so I am so excited that they get to try these. And she made these cute little things on their since their half birthday. So thank you, Norma. I hope you're watching. Thank you so much. Um, I, they've been sitting by my desk this whole time and I keep forgetting to show it. So she said, I hope you're um, doing well. Um, but thank you. That was so kind. I really appreciate that. And they will love it. They will love it. Um, Bonnie says, oh, well, just a quirky thought. No, absolutely. I totally, you totally think my mom would speak Spanish, right? It's so funny. Um, let me see. What else do I have to do? Uh, 
Meg says I was on Facebook, but couldn't figure out how to do the chat. I need the chat. I like to see everyone's comments. Meg, I agree, my love. Um, I know I don't get very much chat on Facebook. It's kind of weird. I know I have less watchers on Facebook, but it's just kind of weird. Um, also, those of you angels out there, let me tell you, that have been commenting on the Stamps of Life by Stephanie Bernard posts on Facebook. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Our our um, our views of people that get to see our posts have gone up like by 100%. So now instead of only showing it to 136 people, they're now showing it to like 270 people. And I know that doesn't sound like a big deal, but it really is. So those of you that are just going in, you probably have to just say search Stamps of Life because you probably like our page, but they don't, Facebook doesn't show it to you. So if you go to our page on Facebook, find it, the Stamps of Life by Stephanie Bernard, it's the company one, and just comment on some of the posts, like them or heart them, I guess hearts are better. Um, it really does help. It's like, I don't know who, what, why, where, when, but Ken is supposed to be posting. He was supposed to already do it and he didn't, but he's supposed to be posting a post that says, Hey, this is our diehard. It's our most popular club. Um, are you in, are you in one of our clubs? And so I'm begging you, eventually he's going to post that. Keep your eye out for that one. And please post what club you're in, why you like the club, um, you know, anything like that. We would love to see that because we're going to try to um, do something to that one so other people that don't like our page see it. So please, um, uh, Rhoda says, I swiped left on Facebook and it brought up the chats. Oh, swipe, swipe left. Swipe, yeah. Okay, I thought it had to do with the channel setup to keep the chat up. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Hang on. Let me swipe swipe left that way. Okay, let me try. Oh, no, it didn't work. Let me swipe this way. Nope, that, oh, so I, oh, it says swipe left to see the comments. Okay, so I do have that on, but literally I don't see any comments on Facebook. There's one. I see Paula's Facebook post. I love watching these. It's so much fun. Thank you, Paula. So I get did get to see your post. See, it's weird on Facebook. Bonnie says technology. I know. Uh. Arlette says I don't have Facebook. Does it help on Instagram too, Arlette? Yes, it does. So if you can give us a heart and then like just type in a little short comment. They, uh, somebody told me it has to be three words or more. It would be awesome. Robin says I just tried and it works. Yay, I see it. So Robin, so everybody's telling us to swipe. If you're on Facebook, swipe left so you can see the chat spot, I guess. I know. Crazy, right? Crazy, crazy, crazy. But yes, it helps on Instagram too. Thank you. Thank you. Upstairs Hobby Room says, love the, um, oh, Ken says the post is scheduled for 4 p.m. today, even though I asked him to do it yesterday. Oh, it's okay. So after on 4 p.m. Pacific, we're going to be posting something about, hey, uh, Die Hard Club members, tell us if you like the club or something like that. Uh, Upstairs Hobby Room says, love the fold it and now in Die Hard. Being in Canada, I haven't gone um, going into the kit club because, yes, um, yes. So Upstairs Hobby Room, I recommend you're in the Die Hard Club and the Fold It Club. I really, uh, maybe some of my um, international peeps from Canada can jump in that are in the kit club. They do because it's in a big box, not a big box, but it's in a box. They do charge you. I just don't know how much. Um, Paula says, I try to comment every day now in the Facebook group. Thank you. I click in the search box in Facebook and it shows me my groups and um, there are new posts. Thank you. Diane says, give Ken grace. Yesterday was football day and the only employee required to work. I know Diane. You know what? He He's a rock star. He I always tease him, not tease him, but I always say if something happens to him, I will literally have to hire three and a half employees to cover everything he does. So it's, I know, hi, Lori, my love. Um, so it's, it's like a, he does so many things for our company, like so many things. And then he took on social media just in the last six months, he took back social media. Um, so we could have Dina work on some future stuff. So yeah, he, no, he gets a pass. He definitely gets a pass, a pass. Um, Debbie says, I hate the algorithms. I wish it would just show you the things you like Debbie. Me too. Like, yeah, you like a page and you never get to see it. That's like not fair, right? Hmm. Um, hi, Corinna, my love. Oh, she's in Florida visiting her dad. You haven't seen him since pre COVID. Oh, 
Corinna, I hope you get to go to a beach while you're there. They have good shells in Florida. Hi, Leanna. She says, I'm so late. It's okay, my love. We're happy you made it. We ha we're happy you made it. Um, let's see. Uh, so those of you that watched last night, I hope you got in on the black and white kit. I'm calling it the black and white kit. It's not called that in real life. It's called, I think, day to day. Well, I don't know how that got changed, but what ifs. Um, so yeah, that was a really awesome kit. Number wise, let me see. Oh, we are keeping it on flash sale until tomorrow, um, through tomorrow night, because uh, Diane says I'm team Ken always. He is wonderful. He is. He is. Um, we're keeping it on through tomorrow because there's no way in the world I'm sending an email out on 9-11, right? That's inappropriate. Um, it, today's all about remembering. So we're not doing that. Um, so uh, Kelly said she got it. Yay, 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 yay. Um, let's see. Uh, so, but number wise, let me just look really quick just to make sure what we have because um, sometimes I don't pay attention. So hang on, let me pull this up really quick. Uh, so we're, we're pretty good. We, we probably won't sell out today. Um, we're sending out the email tomorrow to everyone on our email list. So, uh, today we're okay. The felt might sell out sooner than later, but just a heads up. Oh, and then the tag. Oh, I don't have the tag here. Hang on. Let me pull up the tag. The tag's in a different spot. That was like a long story. Uh, the tag, where is it? Oh, we're okay on the tag. I bought extra of that tag because I was like, there's no way in the world. So, um, let me go back to my chat. Okay. Um, Meg says that new kit looks like so much fun. I can't hardly wait for mine to arrive. It's going to be fun. Um, let's see. Uh, Cindy says, I love the demonstration last night. Thank you. You're welcome. It was so much fun. It's so much fun. Um, Donna says, if that paper pad is no longer available outside of the kit, can you do another black and white paper pad in the future? So many options. Yeah, I... I think it was really, really popular. So we'll probably do something in the future also. So uh, hang on. Uh, Valerie says, I love that skunk. Thank you. Um, Ponzi says, Stephanie, when you had your card day at church, people are texting me. Um, when you had your card day at church, did you pre-cut make kits for the people who attended? I'm doing something similar at church. Not sure what is easiest for beginners. Ponzi, yes. Everything was pre-cut. They did not, I didn't, I showed them what a die cut machine did and how we got those cuts, but for beginner, beginner, beginners, do not let them die cut. As it is, and those are the people that were there that are card makers, our class, so the class I did at my church was the class we were supposed to teach in 2020. Oh, and it's saying something about ads are going to be shown. Hang on. No, we don't want ads. Why is it going to show you ads? No, no ads. Um, that was weird. Uh, it was the the class we were supposed to teach at the conventions in 2020. So we had them all pre-cut already. Um, it was a little advanced for new people. But if you have everything where it's just more or less they glue, that is good. That is good. Uh, Karina says, I can't wait to um, play with that sweet skunk. Oh, my gosh. People keep texting me. Um so yeah, it's a fun one. It's a cute one. Um, that ribbon kit is the ribbon is beautiful. Um, April says, thank you for the prayers. We got a diagnosis. It's a mass that affects teen boys. He will need surgery, but at least it's not cancer. Oh, April prayers answered prayers answered. Oh, I'm so happy to hear that. Oh, prayers answered. Um, Valerie says, I pre-cut the bases and put them in a pocket with a stamp set for my class I did at church. Yay, that is awesome. Um, question, will we receive an A1 card base in this card kit? Oh, trying to remember what it is. I'm trying to remember. I can't tell you because I don't remember. I'm trying to think. I did the video about three weeks ago, so I don't remember. I don't remember. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, but we do have a lot of good A1s coming up, let me tell you. Um, how's Cookie doing? She is not doing well. Cookie is not doing well. Um, 
Unfortunately, on Friday, so you guys know she's on four medications. She is on uh, she is on two different pain medications. I'm not quite sure why, but okay. And she is on the co- the one that has codeine in it for her her trachea because her trachea collapses. And that's been happening a lot more lately. Um, it happens probably eight times a day. So um, she's on this special, the A1 circle flip it. Yeah, that one's in the um, the one that we're almost out of, the card kit that we're almost out of. Um, uh, so that's not good. So that's medicine number three. Medicine number four is she has high blood pressure. She's getting old. Well, on Friday, unfortunately, um, without going into specifics, because it's not, it's not pleasant to think or talk about, I witnessed her have a seizure and it lasted long enough for me to scream for Ken and him to run in and for me to like try to like I had my hand on her tummy. I, I at least I was smart enough not to put my hand near her mouth because they there's there's a possibility she, they could bite. But she literally it it was it was horrific. Um, so the vet was of course called. The vet had we have a we have a an appointment with the vet not until ten more days. But um, they said if it's a one time incident. It's going to be okay. Yeah, Karina, I was going to ask you. She said Bella had them in the last six months. It is so scary. It's extremely scary. Um, She pottied on the floor because you lose all, you know, and she was making this weird sound. Oh, it was awful. And her little feet were, oh, yeah, it was just, it was just awful. I was like sick the rest of the day. Um, uh, So she's doing fine now. And the vet said as long as, it's just this one time she's going to be probably, excuse me, probably okay. Annette says, prayers for my husband. We find out tomorrow the cancer is present after his surgery in June. Oh, Annette, keep us updated, okay? Uh, so, uh, yeah, it, it's it's a bummer about Cook. I know she's getting older. Um, as long as she's not suffering, though. So that's another thing I'm going to be talking to the vet about is, you know, I'm not going to let her, I'm not going to let anything bad happen to her. Um, oh, Layla said um, her 15-year-old Cocker Spaniel started having seizures four months ago. Yeah, they say that it just starts happening sometimes when they're older. Thankfully, I was home. Um, not that I can really do anything during the seizures, but um, they said that you're to cool them down, you're supposed to like put their after it's over, put their paws into uh, cool water and try to get water. She wouldn't drink, but I was putting water on her tongue because she was panting because they get overheated. So, um, yeah, I know. It's kind of a bummer. Um, it, it's, yeah, it's really, Chris had a cat that had seizures. So, um, oh, Karina said Bella had two in 24 hours, which isn't good, but she didn't have another one for months. Yeah, Wow. Uh, and she said they don't suffer during them. Yeah. And, and she was like, afterwards, she was a little day. She was like, what the heck just happened? But then after literally 10 minutes after she was totally fine and sitting on the couch with me. So I don't really thinking about things like that. So, uh, yeah, moving on. Let's see what else happy can we talk about? Um, yeah, it, it, it was very scary. It was very scary. Um, I do not like the Kindle the boys have. Russ, I know you told me that the Kindle is not as responsive when I touch it. That just sounded really weird. Um, but, um, okay. So like I bought this Kindle for the babies, right? And I'm like, oh yeah, we are going to use this only when we go in the car. Cause it t- takes a while to get to Knott's Berry Farm. So I'm like, oh yeah, I'm going to download a movie, to, uh, not a movie or a show to it. I'm going to download a show to it. And we're going to watch it on the way there. So they're, so they're happy. Right. So I'm like, okay, cool. So I turn it on and it comes on and I have my little password and then I'm like, okay, I want to die cut, die cut. I want to download dummy. I want to download something from, and I think it was prime video. Cause I'm like, okay, prime is Kindle, same thing. So I'm like, okay, so I'm going to download something on prime and then I go into it. 
and I'm opening Prime and I say it's for the kids. So they'll show me kids shows. And I'm like, okay, so I want to download Cookie Mouse because they love Cookie Mouse, right? So I go here and it says download season one. Now watch if it works, I'll be so excited. So it says download season one. And it says, what kind of language? I don't get English. And then it says, how do you want to download it? Best, better, good, or data saver? So I'll just say good because they don't need HD. That's only one gig. This has 32 gigs memory. So I say start download. Okay. And then it says warning. And then it says download error. We're unable to download to your device's SD storage card. Please try your download again. If the problem continues, try using a different SD card. It's brand new. Why would not? I don't even know where the SD card is. I think it's, I think, I don't know. But it is so annoying. So I think what's going to happen is Stephanie might need a new iPad and then they might get my old one and I'll just put a nice case on it because I do not recommend this. I am so disappointed. And for the kids section for Kindle, they have shows I would never let my children watch for kids. They have it in the kids section. So I'm very disappointed. Leanna says, please, uh, more prayers for my sister, Leslie. Her cancer has spread uh, and she's been given to hospice. This is new and she is still doing as well as possible at home. Oh, Leanna, I wrote it down, my love. Oh, big hugs to you. That's not easy for you either, is it? Oh, oh, honey. Um, uh, oh, we do, Valerie, we do have a Rainbow Bridge Pet Sympathy stamp set. We do, we do, we do. It's a cute one because it has a, it's literally a bridge and a rainbow. So go search that. I think if you just search rainbow or pet, it will come up. Sadly, we need that stamp set, huh? Yeah, sadly. Um, uh, so let's see. So yeah, Kendall, I do not recommend. Russ, I need your help. Russ is my tech guy. <laughs> Besides Ken, he's my tech guy. Okay, what else? Oh gosh, it's almost 11. Um, what else? Uh, let me see. Um, making sure I don't have anything over here. Working on some new products. It's taking me longer than I thought it would. New products always take forever. They always, always do. Um, hang on. Let me make sure that's over here. Oh, oh. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Okay. We're good on those. Um, oh, wait. What's this? Hang on. Oh, no. Here's a card. Here's a card. Who's this for? Oh, this is must be from Nancy. Nancy, because I I, already, I didn't get to read this yet. It was it was stuck behind something. But I, whenever I see an alligator, I know it's Nancy. So Nancy sent this adorable card for my birthday, and I love she uses just, used just one of those regular date stamps. I love that idea, Nancy. Um, I'll have to link one on my Amazon page. But that's such such a cute idea. We don't need to sell those because you can buy them cheap on Amazon. Are you going to have more five by seven bases, Pamela? Yes, love. Yeah, five by seven. But she made this cute slim line box it card, box card. Look how cute it is. She added some extras because she lives in Arizona. Birthday hugs, be careful of those points. <laughs> and then she's gonna look how cute this is. And it says, belated birthday wishes from Surprise, Arizona. She lives, um, she lives pretty close to Tiff. I don't know how close, but um, look how cute that is. Isn't it's like double-sided? I love it. I love it from Arizona. Isn't that cute? And of course our boxes fold flat for mailing. Isn't that awesome? So thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Nancy. Russ says, I don't know where the SD card is in a Kindle, but I wonder if that's an extra that you buy separately. But Russ, that doesn't make sense because this has like 32 gig memory. Shouldn't it just go onto the thing? I don't know. I'll Google it. I'll Google it. Sandy says, are you sure it came with SD card installed? Oh my word. I don't even know if I can get it out of this case because it's like the kid's case. Does it come out? Oh, I guess it does come out. Oh, look, it does. Oh, oh, it does. Oh, well, that makes life a lot easier. You can find the buttons easier. So hang on, SD card. Where would an SD card? Well, there's not that many places for an SD card to go. So you know what, you guys? Did you notice me doing this? I went like this. <gasps> I think I have to go get my eyes redone. Remember I had the the lace it it doesn't have an sd card okay hang on 
So just for kicks, I have an SD card right here. Well, I think this is an SD. Ooh, this one says Ultra. I think this is an SD. Hang on. The boys have these little cameras. You guys, I have to show you these little cameras. How can it not have an SD card? What is the point of my life if it doesn't have an SD card? Hang on, guys. Okay, so retry. How will you use this SD card as internal storage? Oh, format. Uh, okay. Oh my gosh, I hope there's nothing important on it. Okay, but while it's doing that, you guys, we got these cameras for the boys. Hang on, you guys gotta see these. We got these little cameras for the boys and they look like junk. I promise you they look like junk, but they take real photos. Hang on, is this one turned on? Hang on. Oh, is it not charged? Oh, there it goes. Look, oh, it has a little screen. And let me see if they've taken any pictures. Let me see. Uh, if this one has a card in it, I don't know. Uh, hang on. Oh, wait, maybe I have to put a card in. Where did that card go? This is the cutest thing. Oh, I'm going to have to put these on my Amazon because look at this. They're cheap, too. They're, like, so cheap. Hang on. Is there a card in there? Oh, no, there is a card in there. Hang on. Oh, wait, I think you have to like this. There you go. Watch this. Okay, look, look, they took a picture. Of, can you see it? They took a picture of me. Isn't that cute? And you can, I, I guess you could probably print these. But, it, okay, Diane says her nephew has this camera and he loves it. It is so cute. And and look, oh, I, there's another good picture of Nana. Actually, look decent in that picture. Uh, let's see what else they got. Oh, and then they got my arm. Good job, whoever's. So they both have one. They're really, these are really cheap. I'm going to have to. But it has an SD card in it. And oh, Cookie Monster got to pick two Cookie Monsters because, of course, it's two kids, two Cookie Monsters. This thing is the cutest camera. Oh, look, there's another Cookie Monster. So I have these in my office because I was cleaning off the SD cards. So, oh, more pictures of Cookie Monster. Oh, that's a picture of I don't know. Oh, outdoor picture of Gaga. Hang on. Oh, a blurry picture. But they're really low pictures of Legos. What's that? Hang on. Let me see if I can find it. Oh, that's a cute one of Ken. Can you guys see it? Oh, my gosh. So much fun. I'm going to link these on my... Oh, somebody else's... And that's grandson has it. It is like an SLR. I mean, it is seriously, you guys, they they can take pictures. Like, it's... it's I don't, I don't know how they print, so I'm going to have to try to print one. I have a little photo printer. I'm going to try to print one. But it's cute to see, like, if, like there's 488 pictures on here. So that, and it's only, like, I don't know how many gigs. I don't know. But it's totally cute. Okay, let me see if I got this done. Okay, so um, it, it is the cutest little camera. And this thing always turns off so fast. Okay. 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 Sorry, guys. I got to go. I don't even know. Slow storage device. You can still use this SD card, but it may be slow. Oh my word. Move contents later. I don't know. Okay, it's ready to use. Okay, now just download it. That's all I'm asking is download it. Just download it. Just download it. Please just do it. Please just do something. This would just make me feel so much better. Uh, still an error. Still unable to download to my SD card. Do not buy one of these. Can, Elizabeth says, Stephanie, who makes these videos, the Stamps of Life August card kit card number two? The design team does some, but if it's like three cards or something, that would be Dina. Why do you not like them? Tell me why. Uh, according to Google, it is saying that the Kindle doesn't have SD cards. But I just put one in there and I formatted it. So hopefully there was nothing important on it. Oh my goodness. A Jeep fold, it would be cute. Any sneak peeks for the 15th? I don't have any. Oh gosh, it's 11. I gotta go. Hang on, let me look. Uh, okay, so the 15th, I do have a little bit of a hint for the 15th. Oh, there's no, oh, Elizabeth just says there's no credit giving. Okay, then it's Dina. Dina, Dina's like, anytime there's no credit given and Stephanie doesn't take credit, then it's Dina. It's Dina. She likes to be behind the scenes. She's a behind the scenes girl. Um, hi, Cheryl. Okay, so I'm not going to show you a sneak peek, but I'm going to tell, well, there is one sneak peek, the Be Mary. Remember all that Be Mary that you guys loved so much? 
But just a heads up, if you like that Be Merry, you need to buy it fast because I didn't get very many of those. Um, yes, the Be Merry is extremely limited. I don't know what happened, but we didn't get very many of those in stock. Anyway, um, the uh, the so we did Christmas, September 1st. Then the 7th, we did fall because we needed to do some more fall, right? Now, the 15th, we we're going back to Christmas because I had more Christmas. So the 15th, I had more Christmas. Um, oh, Elizabeth saying, Dina, well done. Thank you, you guys. Thank you. That's very kind of you to say that. Uh, Dina should let us know she's doing the video. She should take credit for her work. You know what? I agree, Melinda. I totally agree. Dina is one of the girlies that loves to be creative. She, I, I guess you could call her my creative director, okay? Um, we bounce ideas off each other all the time. Uh, she's she's my, I always say Dean is my right hand and Faylene is my left hand because they got me, they got me covered. Between the two of them, they got me covered. Um, and I say Faylene is my left hand because she's left-handed. <laughs> um, but, uh, Will we order more of the Be Merry dies? Yes, but it's going to take a while for them to get in and they won't be on flash sale. Um, but yeah, Dina is really awesome uh, with all of those kind of things. And I stole her from Sizzix years ago. So, yes, lots of good things came out of me working at Sizzix. Lots of wonderful, beautiful things. Absolutely. Lots of beautiful things. So it's good. It's, it's I, I'm in a place mentally where I can look back so fondly of the good things. And um, it's taken a little while. It's taken three and a half years. <laughs> but no, seriously, I can look back and I can say, I'll, like, I'll be walking all of a sudden. I'll go, oh, my gosh, Kenny, I remember when blah, 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 blah. And and I can only th I only think of it fondly. And that makes me so happy that um because there were so many awesome times there i mean i mean because of them i got to go to south africa i got to go to australia i got to go to england i got to go to canada i got to go to puerto rico twice i got to go to hawaii i mean i i i look at it fondly now so i'm i'm very happy that um that i can yeah yeah because there was a lot of awesome stuff there um so I'm excited about that. Something just, oh, the camera just turned off. So yes. Um, yes. Jeannie says it's good that given some time distance, um, time distance, your fond memories come to mind. So healing for your soul. Absolutely. Absolutely. Elizabeth says that's because you gave it to God and he gave you joy back. That is absolutely true. And, um, and it, it, it's, it's just fun to think about all the good times and all the amazing people I met. I mean, oh, well, for one, Dina. I mean, I met Dina through Sizzix. Um, but just amazing people that I worked with that I got to, um, I'm still friends with. Uh, they're no longer there. <laughs> um, but it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Yep. 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 It's awesome. Um, you guys, I got to get out of here. Uh, but um, yes, and if you always give it to God, you'll you'll be rewarded. Um, Kelly says, love that you can say that and mean it too. Totally mean it. It does take time and it must feel better to you too. It does. It does. It does. So Christmas on the 15th. Okay. So be prepared. Rachel says, sorry about cookie. Oh yeah. Yeah. Rachel, I'm a little concerned. About, yeah. So my friends, thank you so much. Uh, thank you for your support and your love. And those of you that have been around here for a while, um, Thank you. I really appreciate that. And if you can go look for Kenny's post on Facebook this afternoon, like your night, even tomorrow morning is fine. Um, if you just think to remember to go look for it um, and just post like, oh, I love the club. I blah, 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 blah. Or any, any nice, wonderful comments you can post about the club. If you're a club member, I'd really appreciate it. Um, it would mean a lot to us. So I think that post he said is coming at four o'clock today, our time Pacific. So seven Eastern time. But thank you all so much. Have a great day. I got your prayer request written down. I'll take care of that definitely and share that with Ken as well. Thank you so much. Have a great day. I will see you Thursday for Stephanie's Crafting Corner where we get together live every Thursday at 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern, and I make something. <laughs> take care. I love you all. Thanks so much. Bye-bye. And then she's got to find the buttons.